Welcome back to my channel. This is Teresa, aka 50 Plus 2013. I just wanted to bring my most recent haul. This week is Easter week and Sunday is Easter. I feel like since my granddaughters watch my videos, they wouldn't be surprised at what I picked out for them. I really miss making Easter baskets. I used to make them for my kids all the way up until they moved out of the house and they moved out in their teen, their late teens. So I'm taking great pride and pleasure in putting together a bag for my granddaughters. I didn't really call it an Easter basket because nowadays these kids are just too grown and too old for their age. So I just put a bag together for them and I wanted to share with you the content in the bag. But in the meantime, I did have stuff that I was waiting to haul and it's from Walmart, um, Dollar Tree, and um, Target. And then I'll show you what's in the bag. And that way, if you know it's not too late and you get this video, well, actually it might be too late because I think my videos go up on Sunday and Monday and this one will be up, but you can at least see what I got for my granddaughters and maybe next year, maybe do the same for your loved ones. So we're gonna start out with the stuff from the 99 cent store. I went there, I think for, what did I go there for? I think I went there for Ziplocs and coffee cups because I started out at Walmart and looking for some coffee cups and I'll get them from Walmart next time because I really think price price wise it's better to get them there but at the Dollar Tree I did get end up getting five for a dollar and I thought these were kind of cute and um, I'm glad I'm doing this haul because I'm excited to go ahead and use that in the morning I have been really holding out on using it but unfortunately I couldn't do the same with the Ziplocs these are the sandwich bags and the zipper ones and I like to get them from Dollar Tree, 99 cent store and Walmart but you know I need to make sure to have a zipper on it I do use these for multiple things other than food storage so I did have to break into this so I just bust out the side in case if I wanted to try to conceal it when I hauled it so anyway I got sandwich bags I think these are so cute the blue ones for my oldest and it said I'm kind of a big deal and then the purple one, which is my youngest granddaughter's favorite color, all of her stuff is usually in purple. It says, this girl can. So I like the sands on them and everything. They don't even have a desk, but I don't know. I may or may not put that inside of their um, bag. Uh, may return it or maybe just keep it around the house for some other future gift. So then um, I know the trend now is just these barrettes and things. My older granddaughter, she's in junior high school. She's pretty trendy. So I picked up these barrettes, and this is one, and it, they're some smooth ones and some glitter ones. And then we have this one with leopard print, and <laughs> I'll let them decide. I'll close my eyes and toss one in the bag, and whatever gets in there, gets in there. So anyway, that's from the 99 cent store, Dollar Tree, I meant to say. And then this um, package here with a purple hairband, and three elastics and I know this is for my younger of the two this um, pan because since I moved here I have baking pans and stuff but I don't really know where they are so I just went ahead and got one from the dollar store because I felt like it's better than buying one of those disposable ones and you know you might can get these if you're interested after the fact on a markdown at Walmart but these are the peeps and this is in cotton candy and then they have one in party cake. So we're gonna be trying these. I really wanted to stick one in each of their bags, but I'm like, I wanna really try these myself, so I'm just gonna make it a thing where we're, we're gonna eat them together. So then you have one that's fruit punch. And then they had other ones, they had ones that was um, blueberry and a couple of other different flavors. My eyes were drawn to this double pack. I go, what's happening here? So you know how um, Elf usually has the makeup wipes and it's the 20 in a pack for $3 where they doubled it and it was $5. So I went ahead and got makeup wipes because I could never have too many makeup wipes, just put it that way. And so while I was looking at the makeup wipes, my eyes were drawn to this lip gloss and I don't really need another lip gloss, but I just thought it's like a tint it's saying. So hopefully it comes on more of a tint than this color because I don't really want this full-fledged color on my lips right now. You know, it's summer and everything. Oh, well, spring, about to be summer. The thing I have been looking for in the elf section, every time I go where there's 
of products are sold is the, um, the the primer because I hear that primer is comparable to some other high-end primers so I was anxious to try that because I do prime my skin we'll start with these these are plastic cups they were 79 cents each so since my color scheme is pink and gray or whatever I got two cups for my granddaughters because I really only have glass I don't really drink out of cups so I said let me just get a cup for them to stay in the apartment and you know and then while I was at it, I got them some bowls. And the reason why I got these bowls is not necessarily for them to eat their meals out of, but when they're snacking, I just don't want crumbs anywhere. And you know how kids are. So as long as they carry this and hold their mouth over it, they can eat on the couch or roam around while they're eating. But other than that, I make them sit still or stand over the cabinet. Yes, I'm that person. And it's like you get to living by yourself and your standards um, go someplace that they weren't when you had kids. So. I can't help it. I just want to make sure I don't have crumbs and food and bugs and different things. So that's my objective. At um, Target, they had a, wait, let's see, how much was this? Oh, 99, they had a 99 cent section. This is not like the dollar section in Target because the dollar section in Target, things are a dollar, two dollars, three dollars, a five dollars. And I don't know if I've seen something for eight dollars, but this is actual 99 cent stuff. And so I picked up this, this toothbrush set and it's just a spare set for whoever, but it was two for 99 cents. These razors, I just liked them because they were just white and just mine, they just look so clean. It's a five twin blade razors and they were 99 cents as well. And I found these things like on an end cap, like I was heading towards a register and I just looked to my right and saw them. So then with that same section for 99 cents, I picked up a liquid hand soap, and this one smells like the ocean, and this one smells like rain shower. So one for the bathroom and one for the uh, kitchen. Always try to look on anybody, anybody's store I go to, I try to go to their clearance section and check stuff out. So I saw this um, charcoal and magnesium antiperspirant, well, deodorant for um, $1.49, and looks like that. And it smells so good but it doesn't work for me so unfortunately i'm gonna have to i don't know what i'm gonna do with it i don't know but it did not work which i was considering when i got these to put these in my granddaughter's little gift bag and these are makeup wipes but they don't wear makeup so i was thinking if i think of a way for them to use them in their um, regimen because i'm trying to teach them um, routines for taking care of their skin especially their like preteens and all so I may figure out a way to let them have it or I'm just gonna keep it for myself then the last thing from Target is well no there's two other things I forgot I got these earring studs because I'm gonna be sharing a pair with my one granddaughter who's allergic to everything and hopefully she'd be able to wear a pair I have a pair on now this is what they look like and it was a three pack of these earrings and their um, cubic zirconium and sterling silver. And I don't know if you can see that really good. So one gold, yellow gold, rose gold, and these are the white gold ones are silver. From Sonia Kashik, I passed by because I just love that lady's stuff, but I think her stuff is, it's kind of high price in a drugstore sense. But it's quality, and it's I think it's worth it, but I don't know. There's just so many other things you can get for more affordable before you just break down and buy a Sonia Kashuk um, item. But this is a makeup bag, and I think it's so cute. I like the feeling of it. I like the square. I just like that I was going to use it for a little handbag, not really for a uh, makeup bag, because I have a lot of makeup bags. But this, I thought, a little clutch purse, a purse inside of a purse type of thing. You know, the part that you put the everyday essentials in to grab and go, but then you can stick it in a bigger bag if you need to add more things to it, to your bag. So that's all for the different stores that I hauled. And then I'm just going to go ahead and show you what I got in the girls' bags. All right, so my granddaughters are into face masks now. All right, so I just was thinking more in terms of the season and things that they can grow with things that aren't going to waste my money, things that they would like, love. So I picked up these sunglasses for, um, this is the older girls. 
So this is Brooklyn, her bag. So I got her these sunglasses. I put this little clear bag in here, but I'm gonna take it out because I was gonna put some stuff in it, but I'm not gonna be getting anything else for the girls. Then um, some hair ties for her. Gel mask and a peel off mask. So this one is um, melting sugar. Um, it's, it's called matcha ice cream and this one is called it's just called cosmic and so it's two face mask and then this is a unicorn frappuccino mix and they can just make this with my um, what is it my magic bullet I think I have yeah and then lastly a water bottle and the water bottle was 96 cents and I think all of the items in here came from Walmart I had these Hello Kitty bags in my house for probably five years or so. So I just pulled them down and decided to pass them on to the girls. Same bag that I'm gonna take out. A purple water bottle. Her mask is co a cosmic peel and this one is Rose Gummy Bear. So the two uh, masks. Then also the Unicorn Frappuccino. And I put her glasses in here because I have some extra um, eyeglass cases. And these are hers. And they're um, leopard print or animal print. I'm not sure what animal that is. And this is hers. So cute. So they're mirrored. I hope you all have a blessed Sunday and enjoy your family. And if you're traveling, I pray you have safe travels. And with that being said, I will see you on my next video. Thank you very much. If it's your first time coming to my channel, if you'd go ahead and hit the subscribe button, also click the bell for notification. And I do appreciate you stopping by. And for everyone else, big old, big old cyber hug for you.